So back on the field happening right now, the boys Latin football team is playing its first game since football players were ambushed this week behind Roxborough High School and a 14 year old did not survive that attack. Eyewitness News reporter Ryan Hughes is live in South Philadelphia where the game is being played and Ryan, tell us how the players prepared for this game. Natasha, we spoke with the CEO of Boys Latin. He tells me that those players had an adjusted schedule today and they were able to use some meditation rooms to help with the uneasiness that they've experienced over the past three days ever since that shooting happened. We're heading into the fourth quarter right now and anyone still coming to the game, they have to enter through these gates. Their bags have to be checked and they have to pass through security. And there is added security out here this evening. We're told there are several school safety officers. We also saw Philadelphia police walking around the South Philly Super Site. Now, Boys Latin, they are playing Martin Luther King High School. The game was moved up this afternoon. It was set for originally at 7 p.m., but it started at 3 p.m. The director of athletics telling us that is because of a prior conflict. But as you know, Boys Latin was part of that scrimmage on Tuesday afternoon when five shooters ambushed the football players walking off the field behind Roxborough High School. More than 60 shots were fired. Five teens were hit, and 14 year old Nicholas Elizalde, who played for Roxborough, he did not survive. The co founder of Boys Latin tells me it is important to be out here tonight to show support and also to take a small step towards normalcy. After school sports is supposed to be a way for kids to stay safe, and they took that away from them. We can't let that happen. We got to fight back on that, and we have to make sure that they're safe. Spaces for kids to have after school sports. After school programs is a very important part of Boys Latin. And that was David Hardy. He also says that football is a way to get kids excited about coming to school and excited about having, you know, those after school activities. At last check, Boys Latin was up 12 to 10. Again, we're heading right into the fourth quarter. We are live tonight in South Philadelphia. Ryan Hughes, CBS 3. Eyewitness News. All right, glad they're back on the field. Thank you so much, Ryan.